Hello friends, it is day 28 of our garden study. Um, today will be the last day of our garden study. Um, I will be um, going to a classroom for the next couple of weeks. So our next study won't be for a couple of weeks and then we'll talk about trees. So stay tuned for that. Um, so there will be a break in the videos. Um, but I will be back um, for the last couple of weeks of school. Hopefully that's the plan anyway. Things can change. But um, let's get started. All right, so today's question of the day, which part of this food can you eat? Which part should you not eat? So let's take a look at our banana that we talked about before. This is a ripe banana, if you remember. Ripe means it is ready to be eaten. So here we have a banana that is sort of peeled away. Now let's look at which part should you eat? This top part or this peel? Hmm. Yummy. Do you know this part is the part that we eat, which makes it edible. And this part, the peel, it makes it inedible or not. That means it shouldn't be eaten. And I'm going to go back here because I want to post the words. I can't. There we go. Edible or comestible, or inedible or incomestible. So edible means you can eat it, and inedible or incomestible means you should not eat it. So there are lots of fruits and vegetables, and um, most of them, you eat probably most of it. Um, there's some parts that you don't eat. Let's take an apple, for example. You can eat the peel and the flesh, which is the part underneath the peel. But you probably don't want to eat the seeds, the stem, or the core. So those parts would be kind of hard for you to chew and for your body to digest, which means break it down in your stomach. So um, those probably are not good thing, good parts to eat. So if you um, look at your fruits and vegetables, um, think about the parts that you eat that are edible and the parts that we don't eat that are inedible. So edible comestible or inedible, incomestible. Um, so think about those parts. So think about your favorite fruit or vegetable. And let me know in the comments below the parts that you eat of your favorite fruit and or vegetable. I would like to know. Um, for example, mine is the pineapple. So we don't really eat the outside of the pineapple because it's kind of spiky and that I don't think that would feel very good in your tummy. And then the, the leaves, those wouldn't be good to eat either. Now, in different cultures, you know, some people eat those parts. They, um, you know, do different things with them. But I know for me here in the United States that we don't eat those parts. Now, there may be some people that do, but um, I personally don't eat those parts. So I just eat the fleshy part of the pineapple. And then my broccoli, I like the very top part of the broccoli. So the very, um, they call it the crown. I don't like to eat the stalks or the stem. So that's my personal preference, but you can't eat the stems if they're cooked. Um, you can eat the stems and the stalks that still have lots of vitamins and minerals for your body. So that
that is all I have today. Those two very important words that I wanted you to know, edible and inedible, um, comestible and comestible. And um, that is all. So from for now, um, it will be, see you later. Um, I am still going to try and plant a garden. So I was still will video um, that when that happens. Um, I just don't know when it will be um, with me going to a different center. So just stay tuned. Hopefully I will get to do that for you guys. Um, I'm not going to make any promises, but hopefully. So until next video, I'll see you later.